Your link page, which could look something like this, is a great way for you to offer your audience more options to directly visit your store, your business or get in touch with you. Especially now that YouTube has made some big changes in terms of how the platform handles links. As of today, the day this video is published, YouTube makes links in shorts descriptions, shorts comments and the vertical live feed non-clickable. Also, if you haven't noticed, all those banner links and icons are gone too. YouTube retired them on August 10th, 2023. We'll get back to this one once again later. There are many ways and options for how you can create your own link page and then simply link to that page from all your social media profiles. You can sign up for a link page builder tool like Linktree, Link in Bio or any other of the many options out there. But in this quick tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create your own link page for free with System.io. Yes, you can do everything Thing I'm going to show you on a free system.io account and it's not just a free trial it's a free account without a time limit. But before you get all excited and jump out of this video to create your account stick to the end of this video because I'm gonna tell you how you can get started not only for free but even better than free. And if you don't know yet what system.io is let me say in just one short sentence that it's possibly the best all-in-one marketing platform for you and your business. I already made a detailed video about why I switched my entire business to System.io after four years on another platform, so I don't want to spend more time on this now to get started with the tutorial. If you're interested, go watch it here after watching this video. So let's jump into my System.io account and get started. The link page we're going to build is technically just a funnel page, so let's go to the funnel menu. There, you click on the Create button. In the window that opens, choose a name for your link page and a domain. Now, if you already have a business, you most likely already have one or more domains that you could connect to your System.io account and then use it for your link page. In my case, I use the main link of one of my subdomains, so succeed.nyavimi.com will bring you to my link page. If you don't have a domain yet, no worries, you can first use your default system.io subdomain that contains your username. This can easily be changed later. I'll also leave a link in the description to Namecheap, where you can buy a domain if you want. Now click on Custom so that we can build our page from scratch. The currency is not relevant in this case because we are just going to create a page with links. We don't create an offer page to accept payments. Once you're done, click Save. You'll then find your funnel in your account. Click on it. On the left side, you now want to click on Create step at the bottom here to create our page. Enter a name for your page and then choose a type. For your link page, just select Squeeze page. You could basically also choose Thank you page or a few others, but probably not any of the sales pages because we don't want to accept payments with our link page. If you want to expand your own link page and you have other ideas for your business, feel free to try anything and design whatever you want. That's the beauty of building your link page in System.io. So go ahead and click Save. Now you see your page on the left and in the main section we are asked to choose a page template. Now we could actually just start from a blank page, which is the way I would go. But for this tutorial, I decided to choose an existing template so that I can show you a bit more of the page editor and how quickly you can modify, delete and add elements to your page. So let's go with this template here. Here you see again your domain that you've selected and the path under which your link page will be publicly accessible. If you change this path, don't forget to hit save here. Then click on Edit Page. This will open the System.io page editor where we can build and customize our link page. On the left side of the screen you will find all the elements that you can drag and drop into your page and if you have selected any element in the main editor window, the corresponding settings will be shown in that left part of the screen. If you have no experience with websites slash sales funnel builders, most of them work the same way. A page is always made up of sections outlined by a green frame. Sections are then made up of rows with either just one or multiple columns. Rows and columns are shown with a blue frame in the editor. Inside rows and columns you will find all the basic elements that make up a page, like headlines, buttons, images, videos, input form elements, navigation menus and so on. Elements have an orange frame in the editor. So now that we have chosen to go ahead with this template here instead of just starting with a blank page, let's get rid of most of the stuff. You can see that it's very simple to just delete entire sections, rows or just separate elements by clicking on the trash can icon. If you want to add new elements, simply drag them from the left side into your page. Every element can also be moved around on the page by just clicking and dragging it to another position. 
add or change any text you want by selecting it and then on the left define all the settings you want for it, like for this headline for example, that I want a bit smaller and center aligned. You can also place rows and columns into other rows and columns. This is a really great feature to customize your page, but as you can see it makes selecting the element that you want a bit tricky. But don't worry, System.io is ahead of other page builders that I used before. So here on the top you can see kind of like a breadcrumb navigation of where we are whenever you select a page element. So here you can see that this row element that is now selected is inside another row, which is then inside the section. To now edit the selected element or to delete it, which is what I want now, you see the options for this row here on the left side. You can delete it, save it as your own block that you could then use as your own template to drag into other pages that you build to save yourself a lot of time. You can duplicate the element or you could move it up and down on the page to put it into another section for example. So let's get rid of this entire row now and remove all the other sections that we don't need. The footer here I want to keep but let's just tweak it a bit by simply moving around a few things, deleting some stuff and adjusting some settings. You can see that this footer is built up with multiple rows inside rows. This gives you great flexibility to design your pages for all your sales funnels, websites, etc. Now that we have basically reached the state of a blank page, let's build our link page. I know that I could definitely have made this tutorial shorter by just showing you how to start from a blank page, but then I could not have shown and explained all these things to you. So this makes the tutorial even more helpful and valuable, I'd say. What we need now are buttons. Lots of buttons. So just drag the button element into your page and then customize its settings. Change the button text, the subtext, the font, font size, paddings, margins, the button color, corner radius, etc. Also make sure that your design looks good on mobile devices because most traffic nowadays comes from mobile. To do that just switch to the mobile editor view down here and tweak your design if needed. You will see that there are settings that are the same for both desktop and mobile layouts, but most of the settings are independent from one another. So you can see here this phone icon, which means that if you change this setting, it only affects the mobile view, but not the desktop view. The most important part of a button, of course, is what happens when someone clicks on it. So here at the top, let's change it to open URL. Then add your link to where you want people to go. This can be anything, your website, your social media profiles, your shop, your online course, any affiliate offers you promote, anything. You can also choose whether you want links to open in the same browser window or a new tab slash window. Once you created the first button the way you like it, simply click on the duplicate icon and you basically created your link page layout in seconds. Just change all the names and set the correct links and you're done. Once you're happy with what you've created, save your page and click on the eye icon here to preview the page. Looks quite alright for a quick tutorial build I would say. This is a screenshot I made on my phone, it looks okay too. One final thing I'd like to show you, which is very useful, is that you can show or hide page elements from either the desktop or mobile layout. Let's say I don't want these social icons in the footer to be shown on mobile, so I just select the blue row element and then on the left I scroll all the way down. Here where it says item visible on, I unselect mobile. It's that simple. You see that there's now a red frame and a note on the row element, indicating that it's shown on desktop only. And if we switch to the mobile view, we can confirm that this row is no longer visible on mobile. While this tutorial is very quick to show you how you can build your link page, you will of course find many more settings when you play around in the system.io page editor. You can, for example, add background pictures to your entire page or just a section. You can choose different background colors for each section. You can add custom HTML, CSS, JavaScript code to your pages if you want. There's so much you can do and that's why I decided to just create my own link page in system.io. Because I'm free to design whatever I want at no additional expenses for yet another tool in my business. In the intro I mentioned that YouTube has removed all the links and social media icons from our channel banners. What YouTube is using now instead is this kind of Instagram approach with this link menu that opens when your viewers click on it. You can put up to 14 links in your YouTube profile, but if you don't like this or want more option, that's exactly where your own personal link page comes in that we have just created in this tutorial. Simply put one link in your YouTube profile that directs your viewers to your link page, where you can offer them more options on a page that you designed to fit your brand and that looks more appealing. Also, something that I started doing more often is to use QR codes both in my videos and on my channel banner. 
I do this because the number of viewers who use YouTube on large TV screens has been increasing over time. So with this approach, I can offer another easy way for my audience to engage. What I mentioned earlier and want to highlight again is that you can do everything we've done in this tutorial on the free system.io plan. But I also want to be clear and transparent here that on the free plan, this system.io badge will be shown in the bottom right corner. But hold on, this badge can earn you money. Wait, what? This badge on your page automatically contains your system.io affiliate link. So if people who come to your link page click on that badge and then sign up to a paid system.io plan or purchase any of their courses, you earn a commission. So there's quite a neat hidden benefit for you right there. You could stay on the free system.io plan and potentially earn money, which is pretty nice. On the other hand, if you set up your business, your shop, your online course or whatever you do on system.io, you'll most likely use any of their paid plans anyway. Especially considering that their startup plan costs less than a dollar per day, which is much more affordable than other funnel builders or marketing platforms out there. So in that case, you could then just hide that affiliate badge whenever you want. I mentioned earlier that you can get started on system.io not only for free, but even better than free. What this means is that if you decide to get your new system.io account and you use my link, you get a bunch of bonuses from me, even if you just sign up for a free account. Click the first link in the video description down below or scan this QR code here. This will bring you to a page where you can see everything you're going to get from me and make your start with system.io faster and easier. And I'll explain how it all works and why I do this in the first place. But should you already be a system.io user and just want to get your hands on my link page template here, including these cool button animations, you can now get it at 30% off until the end of September 2023, so for a full month from now. All you need is the coupon code. If you haven't noticed, there were letters and numbers falling from the top of the screen throughout this video. It's three letters and two digits, so the coupon code is five characters long and the chronological order is the correct order of the code. You will find all the links in the description below. And again, if you want to get started with system.io quicker, easier and better than free with a lot of useful resources from me, Click the first link at the top. Speaking of resources, did you know that there are several ways you can make money with your own resources hub that you've built on system.io? Watch this video next to find out how.